today I am doing a little favorites video. I'm, I think I'm going to call it like recent favorites. I don't want to do a monthly favorites. Um, it's kind of just random stuff. I want to do favorites for you because there's some things I wanted to talk about. So I just threw things that I've been loving together. Most of them are beauty and fashion, but you never know. So, let's get into the video. So the first thing is this concealer. And I have very blotchy skin. Like, right where my cheeks are, I get real red skin, and nothing covers it up. My foundation doesn't, my powder doesn't, nothing covers it up. This stuff does the job, and I know it's kind of weird to use this much concealer, but I have to do that. Um, this is just, like, something my grandma gave me. I was like, here, you can try this out. I didn't like it. And it's the Sheer Cover Duo, Duo Concealer in Light to Medium. So, that just looks like that. I feel like such a beauty guru doing that. And then next is just a mascara. I just realized that this is the best mascara of all time. It's all I've ever used. So it's kind of confusing for me. But I just, I've tried one or two other mascaras and I just know that this is the best. So here's what the wand looks like. I'm so confused. Like my camera's on this side. It's weird. But this is the Great Lash Lots of Lashes by Maybelline New York. And next up, we have a palette. This is the Wet n Wild Comfort Zone palette. And I know this was, like, raved about last fall. But this summer, I have just loved. I mean, look at them colors, girl. And this is only, like, five bucks. So I think this is a steal. And I have it on my eyeballs right now. I use this pretty much any time I want a really nice look. And next up on my list is a curling iron. This is the Remington Tea Studio wand, and it's just this size wand. I don't know. I think it's half inch to one inch, I believe. It doesn't say anywhere on it. Sorry, but this was about $30, and it's probably the best curling wand I've ever had. So yeah, you know. And then another beauty favorite of mine is kind of weird, but it is just this cosmetic sponge. Sorry if you can't see what I'm talking about, you know, just little wedges. And a beauty blender would probably work a lot better than this, but I don't buy beauty blenders because they're way too expensive. So, um, I just started using this cosmetic sponge for my foundation and my concealer, the one that I just showed you, and it works perfectly. And you can get a whole pack for like two dollars. Next, moving on to a little hair product. This is the John Frieda For Repair Revives Overworked Hair Protecting Root Lift Foam. Creates instant body with natural movement and protects from high heat damage. You're supposed to like towel dry your hair, put this in, and then um, dry it or and then style it. So what I did last night because I wanted some volume in this. I take showers in the nighttime, so I took a shower, then I massaged this, in, I towel dried my hair, massaged this into my roots, and then just let my hair dry on its own. And while it's still a little bit stiff, like in some spots, I think that's from hairspray. And I just think this is a really great product. It gave me so much volume, I can't even tell you. I don't know how much this is, sorry, but that's what it is. And next on my list, I don't even know why I have this. My grandma, when she died, I got some stuff from her, like, makeup, all her makeup and stuff, and this was in it. This is the Tide Swash Fresh It Up Clothing Odor Outer at Large. So, you take the top off, and it's just this little spray bottle, if you can't see it, and you spray it on your clothes. Like, you hold it away and spray it on your clothes and it freshens them up. And I used this yesterday because I had a cami that I wanted to rewear. And camis can get really stinky. So I used that and it was perfection. Also, gym clothes would probably be really good to use that with. Next, moving on to a fashion favorite. I have, sorry I keep bending over to get stuff. Um, I just want this Saturday. But I, it's more of the idea of them. And this 
cross body bag. This one in particular is perfect. This was on sale for $7. It's really roomy and that has a little pocket inside and then it has two zipper pockets here but this one goes the whole way down and this one goes like the whole way down to the bottom and it's just really really great um, especially if you go to school or something I don't like to lug around a big purse but 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 you know you can if you want um so yeah crossbody bags are amazing and these style are really in and then shocker another leather item um this is my fashion favorite first i'll show you this one and it is circle skirts slash skater skirts i've just been loving them on myself here's this faux leather one that i got for back to school and then one i wore to school today was this um one right here and those are both 25 dollars a piece just about and i think these are really cute and another one i want to show you is one that's not technically a skater skirt and it's a lot longer than one but i like that i can pull it up a lot higher it's this purple one and i got this from a thrift store for church a very long time ago but if you think of this you take this whole section right here off then it looks like a skater skirt and that's why i just want to say i am having an outfit tomorrow that i'm going to wear and you'll see that in my back to school outfit of the week video and one more thing in the physical um and it is this water bottle this is from green canteen and it's just one of those ones with like a sucky straw on it and i use this at the gym and i just thought it was a great thing that i needed to mention because i have never had a water bottle like this and it's not mine but you know i use it and it's my sister's and i just find it easy to do that at the gym so that's good, and this is only a couple bucks. I don't know where you could get it, but I'm sure you can search Green, green Canteen Water Bottle somewhere online. And then I have one more favorite, I believe that's all I'm going to say. And it's an app favorite that I just recently discovered. I downloaded it a couple, like a month ago, and I was waiting to do this certain video to edit on it. And I just edited it, and it was great. So it's called Video Alicious, and you upload your shots. So what I did was take... I wanted to edit fully my um, outfit of the day from today so I could just do that every week and every day of the week and then by Friday I could upload it. Um, so I went into the app and it, you trim it, you can trim it and then you voice, you can voice over it and you can adjust and then you can add music to it and you adjust, you listen to it the whole way and you, um, yeah, you, um, can adjust when you want the voice to be louder and when you want the music to be louder so it's really great especially for outfit of the week videos I don't know how it's gonna work on other stuff filming on it I don't think was too great I just tried that with this video and it didn't work too well but otherwise it's amazing and it is free in the app store so definitely go check that out I don't think I'm gonna link it below I might I don't know but thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video I know I sure did I enjoyed making it and see you later. Peace out.